Guys. Today. Guys. Guys. Today, I want to check out a game that goes by the name of Terra Nil. So, this game came out, I think, about three weeks ago or so. Few of you have recommended it to me. I'm a big fan of city builders, and I've played, I feel like, 80% of the city builders that have come out over the last couple of years. So, today we're checking out this one. Um, from what I understand, it's a lot of fun. It's got this, like, pixely type of art. If you look at, like, the Steam reviews, basically all of them are very positive. The majority of the negative reviews are saying, yo, the price is too much. So, the main negativity that this game has gotten is that it's like 10, maybe 15 hours long. So, in loco hours, it's probably closer to 25. Um, but that's apparently the main criticism, and they're charging 25 euro for it. Yeah, so they charge 25 euro for a game that's like 10 to 15 hours long. Um, I'm not sure what to expect, but we're gonna dive in. Considering, though, that that is the main criticism that people have had of the game, must be pretty good. Someone said this is Dutch Simulator? Yeah. So, I think it's all about uh, terraforming an area with windmills, right? Isn't that what we're doing? So, this is my third area. Can you go here now? Now it can go here, okay. There we go. 99%, 100%. There it is. Okay, so I still need to introduce three animal species. There it is. Okay, so I still need to introduce three animal species. I want to have an observatory. I don't know if this thing... Why is this sandbank? Sandbank. Because I... Mono real? Biggest number. 39? 50. 50 is pretty good. And then we got to put... There we go. Mono reels can then be utilized... There we go! Monorails can then be utilized for recycling to connect your airship to the monorail network. Reintroduce marine and terrestrial animals to help maintain. How is this not a valid location? Try and discover some more animals on this one. On this one. Guys, it's time. We are gonna go to Canada. That would fill up that thing. Oh, it always showed me a little. Why does it not show me a little indicator to unlock that next tier? Why does it not show me a little?
Why does it not show me a little indicator this time around on the radial circle thing? Why does it not show me a Okay. Alright, so I got started with this game yesterday, and I played it for like four hours? Maybe five? I don't know. I played it for a while. And I had a really good time. Although this game is... And I want to put down an excavator like that, so I think that's what you're supposed to do anyways, but it's always... Yeah, so we can kind of... Boom! I think that's good, no? Okay, more water? I think that's really good. I th I think that's really good. I think that's really good. I th yeah, I think that's really good. So we also have these rivers so we can actually... I got this. A tidal turbine uses ocean currents to generate electricity. Must be placed in the deep ocean. Is this the ocean? To recycle both. Okay, so I also got this. This doesn't look like an ocean to me, but then again, I was fuck oh, dude, look at that. That is... There's a lot of current. You'd imagine that this is... Okay, we'll start over here. It's like an underwater wind... Okay, we'll start over here. It's like an underwater windmill? A sea windmill? Yo, you guys know just the right things to say. Okay, we'll start over here. It's like an underwater windmill? A sea windmill? Yo, you guys know just the ocean to create a lagoon. Absolute tank. It's fun. Safe at this point, but I don't know. Oh, you can restart the face, actually. Okay. That uh, thalass uh, thalassic purifier cleans a complete. Uh, thala uh, thalassic purifier.
Valley. Guy. Yep. Um, I'll continue playing next time. Yep. Mm -mm -mm. This is a different. Okay. Here, Echo Soul. Uh, yeah, this was definitely not a mechanical. Uses resonance to excavate a small area. He's done this map twice, actually. Uses resonance to. Uses Fine balls. Okay. It's a little bit of RNG though. Could You'll need to begin by You'll need to begin by cleaning the surrounding oceans and reintroducing plant life. I can do that. Wouldn't be surprised if they also lived in this Like I, I when people first taught me about the monetization in FIFA, I actually thought they were joking. Maybe there's still a little bit of nerd shaming. Yeah, that may very well be the reason. When people first When people first taught me about the monetization in FIFA, I actually thought they were joking. It's actually insane. I thought like, I, I actually kind of thought that like being forced to basically buy the, the same game every year was already a little, a little shitty. And we'll see. I've been playing this game off and on for like, too long at this point.
Half? Okay, sorry. Loco, please, it's the only joke I hear. We're gonna have to do multiples in that case. Okay, okay. David, you can do it. Why does it sometimes not create the... Why does it sometimes not create those things? I don't quite understand it. Apparently the people on the- Apparently there were a lot of seats still available in the lifeboats in the Titanic, guys. Apparently the people on the lifeboats- Apparently there were a lot of seats still available in the lifeboats in the Titanic, guys. Apparently there were a lot of seats still available in the lifeboats in the Titanic, guys. Apparently the people on the lifeboats were like, yo, we can't steer closer to the plips. Because, you know, they might all try to come on board. And they grow too high for this thing. The humidity is too high. Actually getting the objective done. The humidity is too high for this thing. <laughs> okay, I guess I should just let it run and then wait until it's done. Yeah, now it's gonna be too cold and my humidity is gonna be too low. Or too hot. What? Yeah. Maybe eight. I recommend it. I'm gonna give it, but it is definitely one of those games that will be on sale at some point, and I wouldn't be surprised if you can pick up uh, something like this for like three bucks in the future. I recommend it. I'm gonna give it, I mean, it's not amazing. It has a couple of little quirks here and there. I think I'm gonna give this game eh, between a seven and an eight out of 10. Maybe seven, maybe eight. 